Hello, sports fans and baseball fans. It's me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke. And today, I'm here with a game that um, I haven't played in a while, and that's going to be Payoff Pitch. And today's Payoff Pitch um, participants are going to be the 1954 Brooklyn Dodgers taking on the 1969 Chicago Cubs in Chicago, in Wrigley Field, and um, we will get on. I will read the lineups to you as the lineups come up. Uh, the pitching matchup today is going to be Johnny Padres on the mound for the Brooklyn Dodgers, and Ken Holtzman will be the pitcher for the 69 Cubs. So the uh, Dodgers will be up first, and their lineup is going to be Jackie Robinson leading off and playing second base, Pee Wee Reese batting second and playing shortstop, Gil Hodges will be the first baseman batting third, Duke Snyder will be in the cleanup spot in center field, followed by Jim Gilliam in the right field, Carl Ferrillo, the left fielder, Don Hoke will be at third base today, and batting seventh. Roy Campanella will be the catcher today for the Dodgers and the pitcher batting ninth, Johnny Padres. And they are going up against the home pitcher and that is Ken Holtzman. And we will, um, now again, you, you may not be able to see the dice rolls. Um, you probably can't. You may not be able to see some of the cards. Whatever you can't see, I'm sorry, you know, uh, it's only so much I can do um, and um, to make it, um, you know, to get everything I need to get into in, into the screen. So Jackie Robinson's up and uh, the, the uh, six dice roll is a four on Holtzman, which is a tough and then it's a uh, 79, so a tough 79. you got to believe that's going to be off the card, and it is. And it's going to be an F8. So that is going to be a fly out to center field for Robinson. And Pee Wee Reese is the batter. And Pee Wee Reese, they get a 12. They roll a 12 on Holtzman, which is wheelhouse. And it's a 26, wheelhouse 26 against a lefty is going to be a double. So Pee Wee Reese rips a double and he is up at second base. Holtzman giving up a hit, first hit that he's allowed. And Gil Hodges, the first baseman, is up. And that's going to be a two and an eight. Two is an in play and an eight against a lefty is going to be a single. And we will pick the card to see what kind of single it is. And the uh, single is opposite field into right left field. Runner on first advances one base. Runner on second scores. So we've got a, a base hit that scored Pee Wee Reese. And uh, all of a sudden, the... Uh, Dodgers are up one nothing, and Duke Snyder is up. Not that that would be surprising. <laughs> they were good. Uh, four and um, a, a six. Four and a six. That's a tough on Holtzman, and a six tough against a lefty is a strikeout. So Snyder strikes out. That'll be the first K of the game for um, Holtzman. And there are two down. And uh, Jim Gilliam up. Jim Gilliam is going to get a four on Holtzman, which is a tough. And that is a seven. A tough seven is going to be a strikeout. And so Holtzman strikes out the last two guys to get out of the inning. But he did allow a run. And we go to the bottom of the first inning. And again, this is the inning marker right here, so you can tell what inning we're in. Um, and now we will go through the Cubs lineup. The Cubs will lead off with Ernie Banks. Let's play six. He's a first baseman. Glenn Beckert will bat second. He's playing second. Jim Hickman, the right fielder, bats third. 
Ron Santo, the third baseman, will bat in the cleanup spot. Billy Williams, the left fielder, will bat fifth. Then Randy Hundley, the catcher. Al Spangler is in center field today. Don Kessinger is batting eighth. And then the pitcher, uh, Ken Holtzman, batting in the ninth spot. So we will get on with the game. Ernie Banks up. And he gets a 12 on Johnny Padres, which is a ballpark. And it's a ballpark 27 uh, for a right-handed batter. And that is going to be wheelhouse, and we will roll for the uh, we'll roll for the wheelhouse. Roll in the wheelhouse section, and that is going to be an 84, unfortunately. So that's going to be a ground ball six, ground out to the shortstop, six to three, and Beckert is up. Beckert gets a 6 and a 75, so 6 on um, Padres is a tough, and a 75 is off the card, and that is going to be an F8, so Beckert flies out, and Jim Hickman is up with 2 down, and that is a 10 and an 82. 10 is a tough and an 82 off the card, that's going to be a 6 to 3. So the Cubs go quickly in the first. They get no runs. We go to the top of the second. With the Dodgers ahead, one nothing, and Carl Farillo is the batter. And that's going to be a 10 and a 66. So uh, 10 on Holtzman is an in play, but a 66 will be off the card. And that is going to be a 4, ground out 4. So that is a four to three, ground out to the second baseman. Don Hoke is the batter. He is playing center or third base today. And that is a five and an 82. So uh, five on Holtzman is patient, and an, but an 82 is off the card. It's a ground out six to three. And Roy Campanella, the catcher, is the batter with two down, and he gets a seven, and that is a 76. Seven and 76 is an in-play 76, which is going to be a an F8, and he is out, and no runs come across for the Dodgers. In the top of the second, we go to the bottom of the second with Ron Santo, the third baseman for the Cubs, as the leadoff hitter against um, Padres. He gets a 10 and a 35. 10 is a tough, and a 35 against a lefty is a strikeout. So that's the first uh, strikeout for Padres. Billy Williams is up, and he gets a 6 and a 95. So six, it's probably going to be off the card. It's a tough 95. That's an F9. So both pitchers pitching really well here early. I mean, Holtzman gave up a run, but uh, Hundley is up, and he gets a two and an eight. Randy Hundley, that's the wheelhouse, and an eight is a home run. If I'm reading this right, and it is. So Randy Hundley ties the game with a home run. And that was the first hit allowed by Padres, as well as the first run. And we have ourselves a tie game here with Al Spangler, the batter. He is the center fielder. That's a seven and a 46. Seven is an in play 46 against a lefty. That's going to be a single. So Spangler gets a base hit, and Padres gives up a second consecutive hit. All of a sudden, he's they're 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 getting to him. Don Kessinger is up, and he gets a five and a nineteen. Five is a patient, and a patient nineteen is a walk, putting runners at first and second with Padres up, or with uh, with um, Holtzman up. So. Padres walked the guy, and yeah, all of a sudden, Padres is just losing it here. 
So Ken Holtzman is the batter. And he gets a 10 and a 77. That's going to be probably off the card. It's a 10 tough. 77, that's going to be an F8. He flies out. The Cubs threaten and score, but we go to the top of the third in a tie game at one. And now Johnny Padres is up. He is the batter. And he gets a five and an 80. So that's going to probably be off the card. It's a five is a patient and an 80 against a lefty is going to be an out and it's going to be an F8. Padres flies out. We go to Jackie Robinson. One down. And that is a four and a 74. Jackie Robinson, four is a tough. And a 74 is off the card. It's going to be an F8. So he has flown out to center twice so far this game in his two at bats. And Pee Wee Reese is the batter. He gets a six and an 85. He doubled last time. Six is a tough, though, and an 85 will be off the card, and that's going to be a ground out to the shortstop. Six to three, and Brooklyn gets no runs in the third. We go to the bottom of the third, and um, that brings up Ernie Banks, top of the order. Ernie Banks gets a 10 and an eight. Uh, 10 on Padres is a tough. And an eight is a strikeout. So Padre strikes out his second man of the game. Glenn Beckert is up. Glenn Beckert gets a nine and an 80. So nine is a patient, but an 80 is going to be an out, and that's going to be an F8. The Cubs with two quick outs here. And bringing up Jim Hickman, the first baseman. and uh, Or is he the, you don't know, the right fielder, sorry. Um, and that is a four and a 96. Four is a tough. 96 is off the card. And that's going to be an F7. So the Cubs went quickly there. The teams are basically going quickly, except for a quick lightning strike in um, the... Um, First inning for uh, Brooklyn and in the uh, third inning for the Cubs, which have tied the game at one. And that's where we are with Gil Hodges, the batter. And he gets a 10 and an 85. So a 10 on Holtzman is an in play, but an 85 is going to be a 6-3 to three ground ball, ground out. Duke Schneider is up and he gets a nine and a 79 on uh, Holtzman is a patient and a 70 is going to be he just misses getting hit by a pitch and it is going to be a six to three as well ground out to the shortstop and Jim Gilliam comes up it's surprising I've only picked I've only had to use one fact card here Nine and a 57. Nine on Holtzman is a patient. And a 57 is going to be a single. So Gilliam gets a hit. That's the third hit allowed by Holtzman. With two down and Carl Ferrillo up. And he gets a six and a 77. Six is a tough. 77 is going to be off the card. And it's going to be an F8. And... No run score for the um, for the Brooklyn Dodgers in the fourth. We go to the bottom of the fourth. We're moving right along here. Ron Santo, the third baseman, is up for the Cubs in a 1-1 game. Nine and a 37. So nine on Padres is a patient and a 37. Got to believe he's going to get on base with that. He does with a walk. So... Billy Williams is aboard, or Ron Santo is aboard with a walk. Padres walking the man. And Billy Williams is up. Billy Williams gets a 7 and a 49. 7 is an in play, and a 49 is going to be off the card, and it's going to be a ground ball 
three. It's a ground ball to the first baseman. Uh, we will um, figure out whether that's a double play. Uh, the pitcher is a double play nine, and he is a double play seven. So this has to be, I roll the dice again, and if it is a, uh, if it is a nine or less, let me see, let me just check that again. If the result is less than both ratings, it's a double play. All right, so I'm going to say if it's equal to or less than both ratings. And it is a nine, so it is equal to, so it is a double play, and then they are out of the inning. Or no, they're not. No, there's two outs. But there's, yeah, there's two down. And that was a three, a th we'll call it a three, six, one. And uh, Hundley is up. Hundley with two down, nobody on. That is a two and a 37. And he, al uh, he already has a home run today. And two on Padres is Wheelhouse. And a 37 is another home run. Hundley has hit another home run. So Hundley has been a thorn in the ass of Padres, who gives up his second run and his um, second home run. And that brings up Al Spangler. And Spangler got aboard last time with a hit, 9 and an 83. 9 is a patient, and an 83 is just off the card, and it's an F8. So the Cubs strike for another run in the fourth inning. Um, so it is two to one Cubs here as we go to the top of the fifth. And Don Hoke is the batter. That is a nine and a 12. So nine is pretty good. Um, or a, I mean, a 12 is pretty good, but let's see what the nine is. Nine is... Um, on Holtzman is a patient, patient, so that's going to be a walk. So Hope gets a walk, gets aboard with a walk. Holtzman walking his first guy. That's his first walk of the day. Man aboard, Campanella up. He gets a 6 and a 42. 6 on um, Holtzman is a tough. And a 42 is going to be a single. So Campanella working a single out of that. And now you've got runners at first and second with no outs for um, uh, for the for the Dodgers. Fourth head of Gloud by Holtzman. Johnny Padres. Comes up, he gets a 10 and an 18. Uh, 10 is an in play, and an 18 against the lefty is a single, and Johnny Padres has a hit, and let's see what kind of a single that is. Line drive in the left, run around first advances, two bases, run around second scores. So that's another run, and it's a tie game. Padres knocks that run in. And I believe it's runners at the corners. So, um, Hoke scores on it. Is it Hoke? Yeah, Hoke scores on it. And now Jackie Robinson's up, and there's no outs. And that is a 2 and a 22. Jackie Robinson, a two on Holtzman is an in play, and a 22 is a single. What kind of a single? We've got to check it. Sharp liner drum, drops in front of left fielder, runner on first advances, one base, runner on second scores. So, But this guy does score. So that is another run scoring base hit. 
this time by Jackie Robinson, which scores Campanella, and Holtzman gives up yet another hit and another run, and there are no outs, and there are runners at first and second, with Pee Wee Reese up. And a 5 and a 77, so it looks like he'll get an out here. Patient, 77, but he only just barely gets it. It's going to be an F8, so one away. Gil Hodges is up, two runners on, no outs, or one out, and that's an 8 and a 59. 8 on Holtzman is a tough. And a 59 is just off the card, and it's going to be an F9. And that's two outs. The Dodgers might squander this because they've got a runner in scoring position. Duke Snyder is up. He gets a 9 and an 83, and that looks like he will. Patient 83, that's going to be off the card, and it's a 4. It's a 4 to 3, ground out 4 to 3. But the Dodgers do strike for two runs there, and they take a 3-2 to two lead. And where are we now? We're in the bottom of the fifth. I was, didn't keep up with that, but we're in the bottom of the fifth right now. And Don Kessinger is the batter. Don Kessinger with an 8 and a 60. On Padres, 8 is an in play, and a 60 is going to be off the card, and it's going to be an F9. One down quickly, and the pitcher is up. That is Holtzman. They're going to let him bat. They're going to assume that was just a bad inning last inning. That's a 4 and a 28. 4 is a tough. And uh, 28 is going to be a strikeout. So, let's see, who was that? Yeah, that was Holtzman that struck out. So, Padres gets his third strikeout of the game. And Ernie Banks is up with two down. And he gets a four and a 77. Four on... Padres is a tough, and a 77 will be off the card, and it's an F8, and the Cubs go pretty quickly there. And we go to the top of the sixth. Top of the sixth, and the Dodgers have a 3-2 to two lead here as we go to the um, the uh, top of the sixth. Or wait a minute, is it top of the sixth? Um, yeah. Okay. Now, now I know where we are. Now I've caught up. Jim Gilliam is up, and he gets an 11 and a 72. So on Holtzman, an 11 is a ballpark, and that's a 72 for a guy who bats both. He would be batting right in this particular case. And that's going to be an in play, so I'll roll the dice for in play. And that is a four in play, and that is going to be a double. Gilliam rips a double to lead off here. Holtzman gives up his seventh hit. He's getting hit, hit hard pretty uh, recently here. Uh, you've got a uh, bunting F so with Ferrillo, so we're just going to let Ferrillo hit with a man on up at second. That is a 7 and a 59. 7 on Holtzman is an in play, and a 59 is off the card. And it is going to be an F9. So there's one away. And Hoke is up, but with one out, we're not going to try to sacrifice the guy over. Uh, six and a 60. Six is a tough, and a 60 is just off the card, and it's an F9. And uh, Campanella is the batter with two down and a man at second. They're hoping not to squander this. This is an 8 and an 86. So an 8 is an in play and an 86 is off the card. And that is going to be a 6 to 3 ground out. And the Dodgers get nothing in the 6th. We go to the bottom of the 6th. 
Glenn Becker is up. Glenn Becker with a 10 and a 3. So um, a 10 on Padres is a tough, and a 3 is a strikeout. Padre striking out his fourth guy of the game. One down, Hickman up. Hickman gets a 12 and a 98. 12 is a ballpark, um, and that is going to be, for a righty, that is going to be uh, an in play. So I'll roll the dice for in play. And that is a five, which is going to be a triple. So uh, ignore this. That was not a guy that was on. But now we do have a guy over here at third base. Hickman with the triple. And uh, Padres giving up on another hit. Man 90 feet away with one out. Ron Santo up. He gets a 7 and a 77 on um, Padres. That's an in play, but a 77 is off the card. And that's going to be an F8. And Billy Williams is up. Two down, man 90 feet away. That's a five and a 96. Five is a patient, and a 96 will be off the card. It's an F9. The Cubs almost scored there. They had a triple, but they didn't. We go to the top of the seventh. And um, the, the uh, Brooklyn Dodgers are batting with a 3-2 to two lead. And Johnny Padres is the batter. And he gets a 5 and a 96. So a 5 on Holtzman is a patient, and a 96 is going to be an F9. That brings up Jackie Robinson. One down. And he gets a 9 and a 20. So a 9 um, on... Uh, Holtzman is a patient, and a 20 is a walk. Holtzman has allowed all kinds of guys on, but yet he's really held the team, his team, in this game. Um, one out, Pee Wee Reese up with a man on first, and that's a five and a three. Five is a patient, and a three is a walk. So there's going to be two guys on. Robinson goes down to second. There is one out, though. Holtzman walks his third guy of the game. Gil Hodges is up. He gets a 7 and a 72. 7 is an in play, but a 72 is going to be off the card, and it's going to be an F8. There's two down now with a man uh, 180 feet away, Duke Snyder. Gets a 3 and a 76. 3 is a defense. We've got our first defense of the game. And that's going to be an error, a possible error at third base. The third baseman error rating um, is a 3. So we'll roll the dice and we will refer to the card under the error. Error 3, 5 is going to be an error. So that we'll have to look and see what kind of an error it is. And it is a one base error. So the bases are loaded. Snyder gets on by an E5. And the bases are full with uh, Jim Gilliam. Jim Gilliam gets a 6 and a 43. 6 is a tough, and a 43 <clears throat> is going to be just off the card, and that'll be a G1, so that's a ground out 1 to 3. The Cubs almost, or the uh, Brooklyn Dodgers almost scored again, but they didn't, and we go to the bottom of the 7th. And Randy Hundley, who is two for two today with two home runs, is the batter. Let's see if he can do it again. Nine and a 72. I doubt it. That's a patient. 
and uh, off the card, and it's going to be a four to three. So he, he grounds out four to three on his third at bat. Spangler comes up. Spangler gets a three and a six. Three is a defense, so we'll um, check it out. Um, three is, uh, uh, the defense is not possible error at shortstop. And uh, their shortstop is a three error. And we will roll the dice and see what we come up with. That is a nine. And that is going to be an error. We'll see what kind of error. And it is a one base error. So Spangler gets on by an E6. He's aboard. And Don Kessinger is the batter. And he gets an 8 and a 71. 8 on Padres is an in play, but a 71 will be easily off the card. And it's a G4. And let's see if that is a double play. Um, if it is, that would be the end of the inning. We got a DP6 on the batter and a DP9 um, on Padres, the, uh, the pitcher. So we'll roll the dice. And that is a nine, so it is a double play. I'm calling it a double play because it was tied with the uh, highest. Yeah, I'll say that. Um, so, got a six, four, three. And, uh, now, uh, we're going to the top of the eighth. No runs came in for Chicago. They're losing 3-2, top of the eighth. Brooklyn is up. Brooklyn is going to have Carl Ferrillo as the batter. And um, are we going to take Holtzman out? Let's see. Well, his fatigue is the eighth, so we'll keep him in. Carl Ferrillo is up. That is a three and a 45. So um, a three on Holtzman is defense. We will um, we'll figure out who that's going to be. A possible error at third base. He is a three. We'll roll the dice. That is a three. That's going to be a one base error. So Ferrillo gets on by an E5. That is a second error by um, Santo in this game. Kind of odd. Um, and Don Hoke is the batter. Don Hoke gets a 7 and a 43. 7 is an in play, and 43 uh, in play is going to be an out, and it's going to be a line out 4. There's one down. And Campanella is up. He gets a 6 and a 57. Uh, 6 is a tough, and a 57 is going to be off the card, and it's going to be a G4. And he is a double play six, and he is a double play nine. So we'll roll that. And that's an 11. So that is going to be, let's see, that's not going to be a double play. Um, 11. Okay, so we will uh, check the chart, and that is going to be a fielder's choice. Fielder's choice runner remains at first base. There are now two outs, and Padres is the batter, and they're going to pinch hit for Johnny Padres because they've seen enough of him. So the... Um, Brooklyn Dodgers need a pinch hitter to go uh, face uh, to face Holtzman. Uh, 
let's see, what is Padres? Actually, Padres is the one that's pitching well, really well. Um, yeah, he's a seven now. Uh, they'll they'll take him out. And the pinch hitter will be Sandy Amaros. Sandy Amaros with two down, man at first. That is a nine and a 76. Nine is a patient. Um, so a nine and a, a patient 76. And that's going to be an out. It's an F8. And the Brooklyn Dodgers don't score any runs in the eighth. And uh, they will will go to the bottom of the eighth with the Cubs coming to bat. But we do need another pitcher for the Dodgers. And where did I put the Dodgers? There they are. And the new pitcher for the Dodgers will be Jim Hughes. So close the book on Padres. He pitches seven. And we will bring in Jim Hughes to pitch. And Jim Hughes is a righty, so now they're facing a righty. And uh, we are in the bottom of the eighth. And Don Kessinger is the batter. So there we are, we're catching up. Sure, probably made a mistake or two in this game because it has been a while since I played uh, pegoff pitch. But Kessinger is the batter, and he gets an 8 and a 65. So an 8 on Jim Hughes is a patient, but a 65 will be an out, and it's a 4 to 3. Oh, no, wait a minute. This was the, this was the pitcher. And we're going to let him go. Um, an 8 is uh, patient, and a 65 is still going to be an out, and it's going to be a 4-3. to three. Wait a minute. Who is batting here? No, that was the pick now. Um, we're going to re-roll this because we're not letting Holtzman keep pitching. Um we're going to pinch hit for Holtzman. And the batter is going to be Willie Smith. So we're going to re-roll the whole thing. Uh, with Willie Smith pinch hitting. And that is a 7 and a 73. So a 7 is an in play, and a 73 is going to be an out, and it's an F8. So now, we, now we're on. I mean, it was an out either way, all the way, but, um, you know, wanted to get it right. So now that brings us to Ernie Banks with one out, and nobody on. And he gets a 10 and a 6. 10 is a tough, 6 is a strikeout. Jim Hughes with the K. And Glenn Beckert is up and he gets a 5 and a 29. 5 is a tough and a 29 against a righty is going to be a single, so Beckard gets a hit. I haven't seen one of those in a little while. And uh, Jim Hickman is the batter with two down, and that's a 10 and a 49. <clears throat> 10 is a tough, and a 49 
is going to be just off the card and it's going to be a line out six. So no runs come in for Chicago there and we go to the top of the ninth uh, with uh, the uh, three two lead and the Cubs have to bring in another pitcher. Yes, the Cubs have to bring in another pitcher. And that will be Hank Aguirre. Hank Aguirre is coming in to pitch. Holtzman goes eight, I believe. And Jackie Robinson batting here in the top of the ninth. And he gets a six and a 72. So a uh, six on Aguirre is a tough and a 72 is off the card and it's going to be an F8. Not the greatest day today for Robinson. He had a single and a walk and was out three times. So uh, Pee Wee Reese is up. He gets a four and a 55. Uh, four on Hughes is a tough and a 55. For a, against a righty is going to be a single, so Pee Wee Reese gets a hit. They don't need to be giving up uh, any more runs, that's for sure. Gil Hodges is up. He gets a 7 and an 82. 7 is a patient, uh, but an 82 is going to be off the card, and it's going to be a ground ball 6. He's a double play 7. He is a double play 8. And that is going to be a double play, and so they're out of the inning. Six, four, three, double play. And Duke Snyder would be up next if there is a next. But the Dodgers are uh, ahead three to two here, so the Cubs um, need a run right here to tie the game with Ron Santo as the batter right and that's they got the middle of the lineup coming up so that's a good that's you know they couldn't ask for any better than that and that is a two and a 67 that's going to be a ballpark 67 and uh that is um he's a, a righty and that's going to be a an in play and uh that is going to be an out that's going to be a four to three so santo goes out four to three billy williams is up and that is a four and a 27 four is a tough and a 27 against a righty is just a strikeout just barely a strikeout hughes with the k and they are one out away. The Dodgers are one out away from squeaking this one out two to three, or two to one, or three to two, three to two. Um, but Randy Hundley, Randy Hundley, has, who has been a stick in their butt for this entire game, but he's they're going to let him back. And it's a nine and a 20. Nine is a tough, and a 20 is going to be a strikeout. So uh, Hughes buckles down, strikes out, uh, the two guys he faces in the ninth, and he gets the save. Padres gets the win. The loss, although not totally earned by him, but it is. <laughs> Holtzman gets the loss, but that's how you stand right now, and that is the end of the game. With the score, the 54 Brooklyn Dodgers, 3, and the 69 Chicago Cubs, 2. And that will be it for me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.